Okay, hi guys, I'm back with part two. And I'm so excited because I can see she used Serena B's Spooky Pastel Collection on here. So I'm like super excited to get into that. But first, you guys, look at this cute little Mickey Mouse ghost card that she made for me. And I don't know if you can tell, but it has glitter on the inside. Maybe the lighting isn't. And right there, too. And look at Pluto. He's so cute. You can tell she took a lot of time to like make this. And I really appreciate that. Hold on, let me try to get it open. Oh man, I, I just knocked on Frankenstein. To Andrea and family, have a spooktacular Halloween. Sending all the love from Southampton, UK. Pip and family. Thank you. So that came inside of this orange envelope back here with my name on it. And then inside of this green one. She sent me some of the embellishments from Serena B's channel. So check out Serena B too, you guys. And also check out my friend Possum Pip. She's really cool. And sorry, I'm like um, really sniffly today. But I'm allergic to our cat. And we love him so much, we're not going to get rid of him. So yeah, I just got to deal with him. And anyway, she sent me some planner stickers and these because we both play PlayStation. So that's super cute. I didn't even know that this existed. And so there's that. I'm not going to open it right now because this doesn't have a lot of time to record. But I'm just going to go through this really quickly. So these are like little um, stickers that I can put to make embellishments. And then there's this. And it came in this really cute envelope that says Happy Haunting. So I'm going to put that there. And then she sent me a paper pad, you guys. I'm really excited, especially about this. Because, like I told you in my last video, I'm crafting right now. There's going to be a craft fair coming up really soon in just two or three weeks. And I don't have any inventory at all. So I'm going to use this to make some... What are they called? Thanksgiving sorry like I don't even know where my mind is at right now like I'm just so excited like a kid in a candy store but I'm gonna make Thanksgiving cards with this and look how pretty these papers are you guys there's four sheets of each one that's a beautiful collection thank you Pip and then there's some of these page flags right here that are shaped like ghosts and sticky notes and she hand makes these this is a thing to go on the keychain, I believe. Or you could clip it onto anything. You could clip it onto a purse if you use purses or anything. And then there's this, which is a, a mail tag, I believe. So I'm not going to read the inside of it out loud. And then there's another mail tag right here. She used the Serena B collection for that. And she had included a picture of her son in here with the Halloween decorations, but I don't know if that's okay with her to share that or not. So I turned, I put the picture in the back behind the other stuff. And she had another this on it to keep it closed. So in here there's a tag with a hat. Hold on, let me like, and I'm sorry I'm moving it around. So it says Hocus Pocus on it, and she had written in the in on the inside of the other one that it was her first time embossing. So she really did a really good job at it. And then there's another tag here, and there's a picture from her local park that she just took a few days ago. And then another mail tag in here where she's telling me stuff, and then behind that I have her son's picture. Oh man, it fell. I'll pick that up in a minute because we're really short on time. My son left this out for himself. And then there's these cute embellishments here. And this, oh my goodness, this is the best wax that I've ever smelled in my life. It smells like Christmas. I, I don't think we have that brand here, but if we do, I definitely want to stock up on that. And so I definitely want to get to the... I don't want to, like, go so short on time with this, though, because look at how much detail she put in. So she made a flip bag. And there's a tag on here, and there's another tag here with washi tape samples and a cauldron shaker. Very creative. There's washi tape here samples. Very nice. 
and I'm gonna go super quickly through this and I was seeing this on YouTube the other day they're like little brooms that are handmade for Halloween and the camera's getting ready to shut off again so I'll be back you guys I'm so sorry well I got a couple seconds left it shuts off around six minutes I think so let's see how much more we can get through here there's a what do you call this bookmark so there's a little ghost on it and she stamped up the back too with the haunted house on a hill Ooh, i want to watch that movie the house on a haunted hill and then in the back and i still gotta open these so i'm gonna put them in the next video you guys i'm sorry well you know what let me do this whole bag as a next video i'll be right back sorry guys <laughs> 